Hello friends, myself Swapnil Swasto and today I am going to tell you how to update your Asus Zenfone 2 to Android Marshmallow manually. So many of you does not getting an Android Marshmallow update notification as I am running the Android Lollipop version right, right now as you can see it's You can see that Android version that I am using is Android Lollipop and in my reason there is not any notification of Android Marshmallow update in my Asus Zenfone 2. So how can we update to Android Marshmallow manually? You can see that it's checking and there is not any update notification for Android Marshmallow. It may take some time but at the end it will say there is not any update available for your device. So let's see how can we update our Asus Zenfone 2 to Android Marshmallow. So firstly go to the google.com and type on the search bar Zenfone to firmware as you can see then you open on a page where there is so many websites to go on you should choose the official website www.asus.com download select that website open it and it will be open in this space slide down and you will get an a firmware option touch on it and it will open the list of firmware available for Asus Zenfone 2 JD5 iPhone ML. So, firstly, you should know what type of software your Android phone running. To know it, go to settings, about, and software information. Here you can see that the build number your Android phone running is having www dot format. As you can see that it has www format when you go to the firmware website you will find that the type of firmware available here is the version ww type and when you slide down you also find that there are also other types of firmware available like jp type versions or there is one more cn type so you should be careful which type of software your android version android phone running you have to download that type mine is running ww dot so i will download the ww format firmware so i want to update my gen phone 2 to android marshmallow here you find that the latest firmware available for asus gen phone 2 is android l version which is 1.198 0.198 version which is launched on 14-10-2016 so search for the latest android m firmware as you can see here it uh, this is the w.4.21.40.144 this is the latest firmware version available of android m for gen phone 2 jd551 ml so you download it here is also you can see that it says that this version is only for brazil's area users only but i make a search on it, internet and i found that there is not any issue coming in updating this version to your asus genfone 2 while you are from brazil or not so i will download this version because it has it is the latest version and i found it's fix some issues that does not fixed with the previous version of android marshmallow versions so here you can see that there is a download from option there this is the link where you can download when you click in it, it will say to download so i already downloaded this file so let me show where to put it when you completed a download it is almost of 1.14 gb in size so it takes some time let me show you let me show you 
where to put the file internal storage here you can see that I put it the file in internal storage directly and you can see that this is the same file that I shown you previously point one four four dot user dot zip and it is almost in one point one nine GB in size so you can see it this is the same file that I shown you to download here upside you can see that this is point one four four and it's in one point one nine GB in size yeah you can see it so download this file and put in the your internal storage directly and some of you may get the notification of system update and if you don't not getting the notification of system update you can just restart your smartphone as I am going to do restart it may take some time to restart it's restarting you can see let me pause for while let it boot up and so yeah you now you can see that it's booted up and started now you can see that this is the a notification of system update file detected you will also get that notification if you put the right firmware into your internal storage now I will select it and you can see that it is saying that select update package you will get 008ww 4.21.40.144 users so one more thing you should aware that the Z00A is my model name you should also check your model name which is your and select the right firmware for you otherwise you may break your Android phone and I am not responsible for any dead fault so select on ok ok let me select it once again system update detected and now click on ok and it will say system update available uh, one more thing you should ensure that your android phone is charged almost 60 at least 60 or above it click on ok and you will see that the android is shutting down power off and the update will start it. you can see that it is powering off and now it will open to recovery mode you can see it installing update system update you can see it it's installing let me skip this process as it takes some uh, times now you can see that it's still running it's a very very long process so you should wait for a while don't panic it may take almost 20 to 25 minutes sometimes and sometimes it's completed in 15 minutes only so don't panic and do not touch your smartphone while this process don't want to don't try to switch off or don't try to touch on any button of the phone just put it off as it is so wait for a while and be patient on this process so let me skip this process as it is so long I will show you when the installation will complete and my smartphone will be booted up uh, now you can see that it is booting up it means that the process is completed installation is completed let it boot it up uh, one more thing I like to tell you that in the first booting up it may take some time so be patient here also and one more thing while installing you should not touch any button of your phone or does not try to do anything with your phone just put it off and go for a coffee 
or have a phone there but does not touch your phone otherwise you may break your smartphone and i am not responsible for any dead incidents so let it boot it up it may take some time and now you can see that it's saying android is upgrading and it's optimizing app and total i have 182 apps and it is just optimized 22 apps so wait for this process let me skip this process it may also take some time so be patient at every step of this process and you should also see the full steps carefully and don't do anything by yourself i am repeating it over over time that you may break your smartphone so be patient and consecutive at that point now you can see that it is a grating 30 let me skip this step and now you can see that it is almost completed and 181 of 182 apps is optimized and one is left dead and you can see that it is starting apps preparing, preparing my contact storage and what is a grating finishing boot and now you will boot up on android marshmallow it's just done now you can see it And now you can see that there is nothing happened to my apps it's all there let me show you it is android marshmallow firstly now you can see that when i roll down to go to about phone and now you can see that i got an android Mars. yeah and you can see that enough notification of system update successfully and now you can see that there is android marshmallow in my device and now you can see I can play this funny game <laughs> I never succeeded in getting more than two numbers score uh, yeah you can see that it is Android 6.0 one install my Android device so and one more notification a bug in Android Marshmallow causes slow and span animation okay this is due to the install Mars normal launcher so hope you guys enjoy my video and you can see it as a gen phone 2 the update, the update is completed and one more more thing i like to tell you that uh, it's notification coming on one more thing i like to tell you that please please be careful while choosing the firmware of, for your device please check down let me show you once again how to know which type of software you should choose go to settings go to software information and here you will find that i have a j00a model and the format of firmware i my device is using is ww so firstly you should confirm which type of device is your and which type of firmware it is using and select the right firmware and follow the steps that i shown you and you will get your android phone updated to android marshmallow so guys thank you for viewing my video and so thanks for watching my youtube video and if it helps you please click on the like button and if any queries any problem comment down below i will help you there and one more thing please please subscribe my youtube channel i will be up constantly uploading youtube video for helping you there thank you thanks for watching my video once again have a good day bye